we got Pops versus uh, somebody here next. What's up, Frank? Y'all moving, dog. I'm gonna hand you your handy dandy mic. Stream, what's up, man? It's ODB here. Fresh off a hot wind, baby. Was that sarcasm? No, not at all. Wait, you won? Yeah, I beat, I beat uh, Rec too. You shit? Really? Yeah, yeah, oh my, dude, you're a god. You are a god amongst men. What's up, stream? Dude, what you, we got here? You must have been hype about that win, though, right? Yeah, man, I'm hype. Fuck it's, yeah. Just, you know, it's, we're still early. Okay, Mark Falco. I hate the Falco. Free and Pops. Ah, oh, dude, Falco is uh, Falco. Mm. I played Pops in friendlies earlier today. He was he was bopping me pretty hard. I'm not gonna lie. Was he? Yeah. yeah. He's pretty good at his auto combos and uh, do you know any game about? Left. Huh? Yeah, too well. Um, do you know anything about this lead free guy, Dom? Um, I've seen him around at a few fests, talked to him, pretty nice guy, but I uh, yeah. really haven't ever, ever, ever seen him on a setup or anything, so okay. this will be interesting for sure. So, I really like playing this, I mean, I just said I hated it, I mean, I don't know, I have a love-hate relationship with this matchup, it's just, I mean, as a mark, like, and I know you, you're, you're Falco too, so, yeah, what are I, your thoughts? Uh, my thoughts is, like, this matchup's super volatile, both characters can fuck each other up pretty bad, right? Yes, Falco yes. with his combo, like, like, I know they say like Falco combos the shit out of fast forward, but he can combo Peach and Marth and you know Floaty. He, oh. he, he still has good combos on yeah. floaties as well. And Marth can zero to death Falco just like Fox. So. Yeah, I was playing a Falco at a tournament before, and he was like, "It's really hard, but if as Marth, you should you should kill Falco after a grab. Like, I mean, it, it's very easy. That's the goal for sure. Plus, the thing with Falco is once he gets off stage, it's very hard for him to recover. He can't mix it up as much as Fox. So Marth has a lot of avenues. Like, here we go. Oh, good job recovery. Ooh. Yeah, notice that uh, uh, Chase or uh, Pops is respecting Mark the ledge because he, yes. was, he was gonna go down there, but he's like, wait, I'm Falco. If I get hit off, I'm dead. Yeah. Like, I can't recover that far. Okay, that was that was solid. I'd like to see some Mark killer out of uh, Pops because yeah. that, that is such a solid option on Mars. Like, that's why they call it the Mark killer, right? When I was playing him in Friendless, he was doing a good job of doing that, like, when Mark is trying to recover, kind of like that dip down low shine back here. That's very less ball to us. Yeah, that's, he was doing that really well. Yeah, that's a really solid option that Falcos do because the shine covers down low like you were talking about, and then even if the shine doesn't hit for some reason, they jump into back air right away, and then the back air covers high. So. In that situation right there, he could get the center guard. See, you got it. You got it. That was a phantom. It. That was wrong. That was a phantom. That's a shit phantom. That's like the. You could get this there. We go. Oh, there we go. I was gonna say that was like the Rolls Royce of phantoms, dude. Like forward smash, like to death. But melee's a funny game. Yeah. Oh, I like that, I like that dare a lot. I like that a lot actually. Ooh. Pops is so good with the spot dodge, man. I'm telling you. I'm surprised I haven't seen a lot of down tilts out of uh Black 3. Yeah, it's down tilt is just such a good approach tool for Marth, and especially against his match. It's a good way to kinda get get the laser pressure out of your face a little bit. You can approach with like a detail kind of grab immediately. He's like that spot dodge. Look at that. Oh, Falco's just got the hops to get in the air. It's pretty close right now, actually. It is, it is. I always find Melee the most interesting when it's in the oh! end. Oh! <laughs> that oh was my sick. god, that, that was, was nasty. Blood free with the sick hit in the dare. Oh my goodness, reverse hit forward air into the air. Oh, oh I would have thought that was going to go. I might have went up air there. Hey, it's pretty even. It is dead even. Bob's versus Lit Free. So notice that he likes to kind of like hide around the top platform and yeah, come down with there. I, I did notice that. I played him in the tourney set a few weeks ago and I noticed that a lot. Yeah, I, I have used that a lot when I play him. I'll, I'll work around the top platform because that's where I know it's going to be. Yeah. Okay. There you go. This is this. Oh, Ooh. Nice. Good. good if, he, there. if he can convert this into an edge guard, uh, almost. Totally. Okay. Okay. Oh, I thought he was gonna dare there. Okay. Good job. Good job. Okay. Good counter. Oh. That's it. That's it. That's that's the, that's the textbook edge guarding like flow sh flow chart stuff. That is against, textbook Marth. Yeah. Down B when they up B. Yep. Down tilt. Oh he could have. He could have also another option there too was he could have uh, turned around and grabbed ledge and then kind of did a like, quick short hop back here. I thought that laser was gonna clinch it by pops there, but uh, life refine uh, made his way back to stage. There? No. Oh, I, the elf there. I think if Pops would have hacked a little sooner off that shine, he could have got it. And it's 
looks like he's out there. Turns to that stock. Okay, last stock here. Let's see what, let's see what, let's see what each, each of these guys can do. Last stock, first game. Wow. Oh, Ooh, this is the, the monster tipper. Oh my gosh, he could have got a conversion off that. I'm surprised he's not up throwing, Frank. Why is he not up throwing? Is that? Is I'm, it... I'm not sure, to be honest with you. Oh, there we go. There we go. I spoke too soon. Yeah. Because, like, I, as Marth, I mean, one of my favorite things to do is just start, like, an up throw, up, up tilt, up air stream on the platforms. I mean, I, I've practiced that a lot, and I've gotten really good at that, so it's one of my favorite things to do. Okay. It works really well on Battlefield. Uh, also works well on the other but he's, he's really easy. He's, he's, he, if he gets him off stage here, he can edge guard very easily. Yeah, I noticed. Pops gets an opening. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Okay, he's got him. Take, took away his jump. Ooh, almost. Well, see, well, I would have went forward with that edge cancel. Edge cancel is beautiful, but you can go forward to finish that. And back here to punch the game. That's. Uh, this is really, really close. Oh, he's jump. Oh, oh, wow, that was ooh, ooh. smart by Pop. See, I love Mars. All Mars need to do that side B stall in the air to throw off their timing. Kind of like a shine stall. Yeah, Just exactly. Stall with side B is beautiful. It throws off the timing of your yes. opponent's moves. And there was something that happened a while back that I, I see a lot of marks do, including me, is they aerial on stage from the ledge all the time. And, they all, and it's easily uh, punishable. This might be it. Oh, uh, that's curtains for uh, my boy Pops game one. That was a hella, cl first, uh, hella close first game. That was a game. great game one. That was a great game one. That game was almost five minutes. That's incredible. Yeah, yeah. For Falco, Marth, for a kid. Switch the team, go play Wings. Go play Wings, OK. Good luck, Dom. Ready? Bye, for Red, joining join me on the microphone here. Okay, so Pops versus Lead Free, game two. Pops up one game. I'm actually surprised. Uh, he was down pretty hard. Yeah. Lead Free was looking pretty good, but man, Pops is just inconsistent. Yeah, but the game one was actually very, very close. I actually want Pops to win the whole, this whole tournament today just because he's wearing a remote shirt. <laughs> and I want the remote Rockets Russia to win a tournament. Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> Alright. So, yeah, I think we're going to start seeing Pops turn it up. Like, I think after you win a game like that, you come into the next game with a lot of momentum. Absolutely, I mean? absolutely. So, like, we'll see. I'm going to expect you. Okay. Oh. So, we'll probably see some of that. Okay. Falco at all times, yeah, honestly. Yeah, yeah absolutely. Come to his curse a little bit Let's there. go. I, th I mean, I think that's just Falco curse, dude. You pick yeah. Falco, you're, you're doomed to a life of, like, accidental SDs in Europe. Absolutely. Right. That's it. For that three. He's really good at finding his, like, weird, like, follow ups. Yo. What's up? What's up? Not sure observing. All right, so uh, man, yeah, Pops is definitely really good at finding like weird follow-ups. Like earlier today, he hit me with the down air on the ground of Dreamland at 130, percent and I was able to follow up with like an up air like on the other side of the stage. Looks like he's just oh, oh, that's oh, I hate that so much. Yes, ask Pops to say it's intentional. Don't, don't believe, don't believe him. It was not intentional. That was a total accident. All right. So, all right, this is looking hard. Pops yeah, is definitely like kind yeah. of just better player. He's he has really good shield pressure, kind of outspacing him in general. Yeah. And like, Lead Free's hits aren't turning into kills, where Pops' hits are turning into like a lot of percentage more kill every time. Yeah, that's a good tipper. Um, I was playing Pops early in friendlies, and I was he was he was about to be pretty good. I'm a Mark man, so. Right. Yeah. So he's, uh, pretty rough. Yeah, yeah. He's uh, I mean, so this is more. But uh, man. <laughs> the fair. And fair is actually awesome if you hit like all three hits, because yeah. if you hit the third hit, then you can get a follow up after it. It's really sick. Yeah. Should be that though. Nah. Bird. It could have been, but he didn't quite get quite close enough to the ledge. Yeah. Yeah. You guys should. I think you could have just jabbed it honestly. Yeah. Like, reset, the, reset the ledge guard. Yeah. But uh, it's okay. The lazy, the lazy, the lazy up smash the ledge. Just take ledge, guys. <laughs> Hello. All right. All right. Someone just grab the ledge. <laughs> I'm actually getting angry. All right, the match is over. Hey, let's go. Oh, you want to play?